Do, 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 do. I got me a cable. I got a cable that is attached to the wall. Hey, hey, can you tell I'm happy? There you go, see, I'm going to sing an intro every time and just make sure that no one ever subscribes again. Uh, right, cool, so uh, here we are. I've just taped it off. Got the cable there. It's 10 millimeter armored schwa cable. Um, and it has been cleated to the wall so what i've been doing is drilling a five millimeter pilot hole uh, i said these aren't going to be to do's uh, or how to do videos so uh, five millimeter pilot hole and then i'm using self-tapping concrete screws um torques just impact drivering them on um some might say it's not the prettiest thing in the world um personally i i kind of like it um but I'm a weirdo, um, so yeah, uh, as sure as shit beats digging a trench halfway across my garden, um, I've done digging in this soil, and I uh, am done digging in this soil, so there it is, absolutely beautiful, equally spaced the whole way, um, do you know how I equally spaced it? I eyeballed it, <laughs> you see where they fall on the brick? It's roughly the same place each brick. Um, you know, just try to keep them roughly equal. No need to measure. Uh, except here, where I started, I tried larger gaps. Honestly, it looks awful. Um, and you can see where I've been doing tighter gaps because uh, I worked, started here and worked my way around. Um, so here is where I'm up to. Uh, next thing to do is measure this distance inside this garage inside the garage i'll drill a pilot hole out through there and then widen it from this side and put all of this remaining cable through that i've taken off the spool already um then when i'm in the garage welcome to the garage there's the new washing machine that uh, took up half my life yesterday um so it'll come in through there somewhere uh judging by the gap probably somewhere around here as you can tell it's an uphill struggle i'm gonna have to move all of this stuff before i can even start um so that's gonna be fun and games but yeah i'll pull the cable through get it re-spooled on here um but the final job will be to get it all the way across and then uh, i'll probably go under the door um rather than all the way around it um and then the fuse box is through that wall absolutely wonderful um this is one of those jobs that i was really 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 dreading i didn't want to have to do it um you know i did i did i didn't want an armored cable to supply the build um how wrong i was i you have to um, if you think there's a way to get around it with a fuse spur, one, fire that electrician immediately. They are not only, only endangering you in your build, um, but they're probably breaking the law. Um, so be very careful, um, especially if that quote seems very reasonable, um, because then they might even know what they're doing and still be sending you for a ride. Um, don't be afraid to do this job yourself. It's absolutely fine. A lot of people are terrified of doing electrics and they'll get their electrician out to do this. I mean, you're screwing a cable to a wall. I mean, even digging the trench and laying the cable in the trench, as long as you've got documented evidence of what you did and how you did it, um, then you can show that to your electrician at the end and they can sign off on it and you know they can come out and inspect it they can test everything make sure it's all good at the end um with that in mind uh that's where i'm up to that's what i've got left to do and because it's a sunday i think i'm gonna get this cable in here and then call it a day because i want to spend some time with my family and that is something you shouldn't be afraid to do either so down tools and spend some time real time Cheers.